how is LF Energy kind of building an even playing field to, as you also mentioned earlier, there's less duplication of work. Mm -hmm. And if you can also mention some projects that are kind of either in the early stage of maturity to replace some of those fragmented or do-it-yourself projects. The data world is extremely fragmented. And the number of speakers that we had today talked to just that of there's fragmentation. Even within a single TSO or DSO, there, is, there are data silos within there. Um, so there are many levels of challenges here. Um, some of the projects that we're working on, um, so Trolley, uh, which is uh, an open source specification implementing FERC Order 881 around uh, transmission line ratings, um, that addresses a problem with uh, the Mid-Continental ISO had of data sharing with all of its different stakeholders and actors and all the different permutations there. Um, you know, they sit in the middle of the continent and have many neighbors and they need to share data with all of those neighbors. And uh, they put forth Trolley to consolidate the industry around one standard rather than have to, you know, speak to the neighbor on the right in one language and the neighbor on the left in another. Um, and so that's one concrete example. We also have the uh, carbon data specification. Uh, where we're working on data standards around uh, customer data uh, as well as uh, power systems data. Um, and that's, that's more driven on the uh, consumer side of electricity, less so on the utility DSO, TSO side. But we're really working hard to get the DSOs, TSOs to buy into that, hopefully solve some problems that they have internally and align all of our efforts to just reduce friction around data sharing overall.